Hi there, I'm Daniel for Kalkine Media. On Wednesday, Britain approved its first new deep coal mine in decades to manufacture the high polluting fuel for use in steel making, which drew criticism from opponents who say it will hinder climate targets. The proposed Woodhouse Colliery Mine will produce high volatile coal, also known as high vol A hard coking coal, for use alone in steel making. To make coke, the coal would be combined with coal from other sources. Coke will be produced either within the steelworks or at a separate coking facility. Right now, Calkine is offering a seven day free trial on its premium research reports. Get access to data-driven market insights combined with an in-depth analysis on financial markets across the globe. Don't miss it. Subscribe for the free trial now. Coking coal is not the same as industrial or thermal coal, which is often of lesser grade and has historically been used as fuel. It is estimated to generate up to 500 direct employment and perhaps twice as many indirect jobs. According to the government, Cabinet Minister Michael Gove determined that the mine in Cumbria, northwest England, will have an overall neutral effect on climate change and is thus consistent with government policy for meeting the challenge of climate change. The project, which was announced in 2014, has been slammed by the British government's own independent climate advisory body, as well as climate activists and organisations such as Greenpeace. Greenhouse gas emissions from coal combustion, such as in steel and power plants, are the single most significant contribution to climate change. And weaning countries off coal is seen as a critical to meeting global climate objectives. Britain has passed legislation mandating it to achieve net zero greenhouse gas emissions by 2050. Well, that's all for now. Leave your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon for further notifications. I'm Daniel for Kalkine Media.